Hello, hello, how are you all today? Welcome to another episode of Peachy's Mailbox. I actually got a handful of packages in the mail uh, right after I did the last Peachy's Mailbox, which was about a month ago, but I kind of felt weird doing so many right in a row, so I decided to hold off a little bit. But uh, time is now, so let's get started. The first one I'm gonna open is a bag, actually. I'm not sure what it is from Amazon. I hope I say this name right, Isabel or Isabel, Isabel Gregory. It just says, enjoy your gift from Isabel. It looks like a shirt. Oh my god, even the bag is cute. It says, dream heart animal cloud. I don't know what that means, but it's really cute. This looks like a shirt. Oh! Ah! <laughs> I forgot about this. Look at that. Look how cute this is. Oh my god, it's like a tank top. It's so, it's like a nylon. That's interesting. I was not expecting it to be like a nylon material. <laughs> Look how cute this is. This is an amazing Sailor Moon shirt. Thank you so much, Isabel. I love it. It's really smooth. Okay, next we have a package from Sean Hill. It says, enjoy your gift and thank you for all the hard work you put into your videos. It doesn't go unrecognized and we all appreciate it from Sean Hill. Thank you so much. This one, unfortunately, I'm so sorry, is, is not quite a surprise, but ah! you couldn't you couldn't see it because of the glare. It's Homura! See, I'm so sorry, Sean, but what happened with this one is um, the mailman, this actually came while I was on vacation, and so it sat outside for a day when it was super rainy, and the uh, package, the box, got soaked. So I wanted to open it and make sure that whatever was inside, luckily this is wrapped in plastic, so it actually would have been okay, but uh, I wanted to make sure that what was inside didn't get ruined, so I opened it right away just to make sure. So I'm sorry that the surprise got ruined, but I squeed. I was so happy when I saw Homura. Now I have a Homura and Monica. This plastic is like so on here. Again, the Japanese and their tape. Oh my gosh, the tape. It's like a Barbie doll from my childhood. It's like they put so many twisty ties and tape around Barbies you can't even open them. It's like, ugh, where do you think it's gonna go? Japan's tape game is real. Here she is. Is there gonna be assembly required? Yes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, just her head. Ah! I think the Madoka figure I actually have is, is, it doesn't exactly match this one. The one on the box is not the one back there. There's actually a one where you can like hold, like Madoka's hands can look like they're like holding Homura's. So that's unfortunately not, ooh, I might have to get that Madoka one too. Oh, Homura is headless. Oh my goodness, she's beautiful. I love Homura. Ever since I watched Rebellion, I like have a whole new appreciation for Homura. I really, actually, really, really love her. Look how pretty she is. Oh, I love the movement. I love how she's like in movement. It's like she's not just standing there. Like, oh. So here's both of them. I, I wonder. Like I said, this isn't the. This isn't like a matching set of figures, so Madoka is like really short, but the Madoka that goes with this one I think is about the same height as her, but oh love, oh no. Makes Homura look really powerful next to her, so oh my goodness, I love them, thank you so much. Thank you so much, Sean, I love her. All right, we got another box. This one is a surprise, this one I didn't open. Ah, it's an amiibo, not really. It's Jasmine! Jasmine is my favorite Disney princess. Aladdin is my favorite. I was just at Walmart the other day looking at this like, oh, that's on my wish list. I really want her. I really want Jasmine. This is from Christopher. Hi, Aurora. Thank you for all your videos. Here is a gift as an expression of my gratitude for all the hours of entertainment from Chris. Shiro, <gasps> thank you. I am going to put her right next to, or maybe right on top. For now, it's gonna be an awesome princess pyramid. It's gonna be the two peaches and then Jasmine on top. Thank you. We have one more box. So let's open this one up. Amazon Prime is the coolest thing. <gasps> oh! <laughs> oh my God. This box is huge. <laughs> yes. Oh my god! 
<laughs> Holy crap, his box is bigger than all of the other figure arts. He's heavy too! Oh my god! <laughs> I was not expecting this at all. Oh my god, this is from Kimberly! Hi Aurora, your set can't be complete without a tuxedo common! Thank you so much for all the wonderful videos and little things you post to me. It's a pleasure being your patron! From Kimberly! Oh, Kimberly girl, thank you so much! <laughs> and it was, this was this was the last thing I was expecting. Absolutely. Oh my god. We are gonna be doing an unboxing of Tuxedo Common. Actually, I just found out that my Super Sailor Moon is on the way. So we're gonna have I guess I guess Tuxedo Common goes with just about any version of Sailor Moon, so any season. It's not like he gets an upgrade to Super Tuxedo Mask, so <laughs> Oh man. Tuxedo Mask! Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. The last one I have is actually a letter. I'm showing you the back because I don't want to show you addresses. But it's this is a letter from Seishi. And I don't want to go into full details about why this is special. But um, Seishi is, is uh, someone who's been following me for a long time. And um, he, he went through a, kind of a dark time a while ago. And... Um, it, he's always been very special to me ever since then and, and um, just someone who I, I really, really respect and he's, he's watches me on Twitch and is in Twitch chat, uh, Seishi no Iro, I think, that may be wrong, but um, so he, he sent me an email saying that, uh, giving me a heads up that he was sending this letter, so I don't know, um, I'm, I'm gonna read it, but I don't know if I'll keep the whole thing in the video, it'll depend on kind of how personal this is. Beautiful handwriting. Look at that. All right. Oh man, ready to the waterworks. Out of all the silly comments I make on your videos, there is one I really want you to see. I felt it would be more meaningful if I presented it to you in this way. It's true that your videos have made me happy from the very first one I watched. I woke up that morning in such a miserable mood, I didn't even want to get out of bed. But watching your peachy party really changed that ugly morning into an entire day of greatness. Since then, I've always made an effort to be in all your streams. I'm really introverted too. It's already difficult for me to make friends, but it's especially difficult to keep them. So very often, especially in groups, I'm the guy that people just ignore after a while. Or maybe they forget I'm there. Or perhaps I just don't keep their interest. I don't know. <sighs> I'm a nice guy, blah blah, all that stuff, but I'm very forgettable, I suppose. Whenever I join you on Twitch and settle in my chair to watch you and simply recognize my name in chat and say hello, that means so much to me. Instantly my day is better just for that, and getting to hang out and have a good time watching the stream is the best. Maybe all this seems silly, but really it does mean a lot. I'm so glad that I hope you feel good just by watching and being at the streams and appreciating your hard work, but I also want to give thanks to you because your good feels make me feel good too. Thus, I can't say it enough, thanks so much for making my day ever so peachy. May you always be peachy and bring peachiness to all whose hearts you touch. Until next time, Gilded Guardian of Love and Compassion. Sincerely, Seishi. I know what that's like to be surrounded by friends and people who you you're in their circle but you feel like you're easily forgettable you're not none of you are none of you are forgettable every single one of you matter every single one of you I read your comments I see your name come up in twitch chat and I'm always so happy, especially if I see you more than once and I see you come back and I recognize your name. It makes me so happy. And don't feel, don't ever feel like you're forgettable. And I'm talking to everyone who is an introvert and feels like you don't fit in. I've been there and I know that feeling. And I just want you to know that your presence does matter, even if you don't talk, even if you don't know what to say, even just being there and being silent, your presence means so much. You don't even know. And, and there's and 
people don't know how to express that. They don't know how to tell you, hey, yeah, you matter, even though you're just here. As I've been a part of different groups, uh, for example, Dagger Hair, that's probably the thing that I'm into right now the most where I'm around real people, not through the internet. And I don't talk a lot. I'm very quiet. But whenever my husband goes to an event and I'm, I don't go, if just he goes, he says that people always ask where I am. They ask how I'm doing. And I'm the quietest person there. And it's just my presence there. Even if I'm not lively conversation, I'm not the best person at, you know, co conversing with people, especially in person, it's very difficult for me. They notice when I'm not there, even though I'm silent most of the time. And I want you guys to know that you are a human being. Your presence somewhere means something to people, even if they don't know how to express it to you. So remember that. I mean, I'm 31, and it's things like this that I'm just now realizing. It, it, I learn new lessons every single day, and especially with conversing with you guys, whether it's on Twitch or in the YouTube comments, I can't believe how much just being a happy, positive presence in people's lives means so much to them and can change their lives. And this is not just through the internet, this is in person. So you've got to know that just by being, just by being, you can change someone's life. Just by being yourself, even if just being yourself means being quiet and being there, being in the presence of someone can be so powerful. And listening, listening is so powerful. Say she, none of this seems silly. This is, this is so powerful. These words are so powerful. Thank you for writing them and thank you for sending them to me. I love you guys and I want you to know that every single one of you matter. <laughs> thank you so much to every single one of you. Thanks for watching this video all the way through. I hope most people got to this message. I just, I've gotten a lot of messages over the past couple days of people telling me how much my presence has changed their lives. And this is through the internet. So anyone feeling this, just know that you're loved. Thank you so much to every single one of you who sent me something. And whether it's in pa on paper or in an email or in a YouTube comment, I read every single one of your comments. And so many of them are just so heartfelt. And I, I literally do not have the time to reply to every single one. But please know that I appreciate every single one. Uh, thank you guys so much for taking this journey with me. I feel like this is where I belong. I'll see you guys on Twitch and in the next video. I love you. Thank you so much. Bye bye.